It's been almost 26 years since Jan Cornell found her 11-year-old daughter Robin and her roommate Lisa Story dead, suffocated and both raped at her Cape Coral apartment in the courtyards. In this interview with Fox 4 two years ago, she described a surreal scene. I knew that she wasn't alive, but I, it was very confusing because I couldn't even sort out what may have gone wrong, what happened. Cape Coral police have been baffled by the case since the beginning, too. They have DNA evidence, drops of blood police say the killer left behind, a set of keys believed to be linked to the murderer, but they were never able to make an arrest. When I interviewed Jan 10 years ago, she told me it felt like something other than real life. It was like watching a movie that is so horrific, you have to close your eyes or go out of the room because you can't watch that part. Probably the strangest thing she found in her home the night of the murders, pictures of her 11-year-old daughter Robin laid carefully on an ironing board. The first thing I saw was the pictures on the ironing board and that immediately I think put me in a panic mode because it was saying something that I don't even know what it was saying, but it wasn't right. The case has been profiled three times over the past two decades on America's Most Wanted, showing the ransacked home and the clues the killer left behind. I sat down with Jan to watch one of those episodes that aired 10 years ago. Back then, she said it was hard to watch, but perhaps the most difficult thing for her was hearing the 911 call she made that night. Reminds me of that moment. The pain that goes along with losing a child. Just like having just, your heart ripped right out of your chest. That's why we can't give up. I was up waiting for a miracle. The only miracle she can hope for now is that her daughter's killer will finally be arrested and put behind bars, even if it's 26 years later. I want justice. I want the person that walked in my house that night and took their lives to not be free anymore.